gonna do some baked salmon with some homemade mashed potatoes with red potatoes and let's go and i'm gonna tell y'all some of the health benefits that come with it i wrote it down so did you know it's 11 health benefits that you can get from eating pink salmon so one of them is you get rich omega-3 fatty acids it's a great source of protein high in vitamin b well the wild salmon vitamin b1 thiamine vitamin b2 riboflavin vitamin b3 niacin that one is 50 percent vitamin b5 pantothenic vitamin b6 vitamin b9 folic acid that's for the pregnant women vitamin b12 51 percent it's a good source of potassium it's loaded with selenium which is a mineral found in certain foods studies show selenium helps protect bone health decrease thyroid antibodies in people with autoimmune thyroid disease and also it may reduce the risk of cancer number six it contains the antioxidant astaxanthin don't come for me it's a member of the antioxidant family and that's what gives pink salmon its red pigment number seven it may reduce the risk of heart disease that's good number eight may benefit weight control it can also help fight inflammation number 10 may protect brain health and number 11 is a delicious and versatile so you can steam it saute it fry it bake it have it in sushi, sushi, grill it, and or poach it. Okay, now let's go. So, I basically had the lemon right here. So I'm gonna clean it. I'm gonna wash it, and I'm also gonna spray it with the vegetable wash. And then I'm gonna wash it again. I'm just gonna clean it and soak it. This is farm raised pink salmon. Just a little for you. So cute. So I'm just gonna wash everything. First, I'm gonna wash it. So I'll get over that fishy smell. And then let it sit maybe like 10 minutes. Turn it on the other side. In the meantime, we're going to cut up. Some red onions, some scallions, some bell peppers, some obey, some Larry's, no Guyanese. I don't know. I know all Trinis use it too. Harvey Flakes, some minced garlic, some Brussels seasoning, and some thyme. and some red potatoes so i already peeled them i'm just gonna wash these as i said and then we're gonna spray them and then we're gonna wash them again <laughs> so tell me in the comment section how y'all do y'all salmon i love to bake it i bake everything And I cut up some stuff. So I'm just gonna cut it. So then we'll walk through this. 
Okay, so we're gonna go home and we used to have to cut quarter cut of food for them. So I just kept it with me because I liked it. I feel like it's easier to do instead of all that cutting and chopping. Not everything, but most things. I would have played some music, but I don't own the copyright, so we don't want any problems. I preheat the oven to 350. That's what you hear, that clicking noise. That's the oven. So yeah, I had stopped when I was pregnant. I don't know if y'all know, I had said in my last video, but basically like a pescapalian, mostly like all they eat is fish, but where I live, we don't really have fish markets. So it's been salmon, salmon and salmon. So I do it like teriyaki, barbecue, baked, with bell peppers like I'm doing today. That's basically it, I don't know no other way. If I do, if y'all know who it is, y'all let me know. Yeah. So, I think it should be good. We don't want it to, to taste like lemon. We just lock it up. I don't know. Having fun. So I just soak it. So we want it to soak out fully and then I put some butter in the pan, but I'll do it again because I had it sitting on the oven. So this is blue bonnet butter. I also like country crock, but I like the sticks because it doesn't take up that much space in the fridge and they're like a dollar, a ten for ten. Every supermarket in the world sells blue bonnet ten for ten. doesn't have that much salt and it's very pillow based. And then I always put like extra butter because the bottom of the salmon I don't want to stick to the pan. So I put an extra, you know, plus for the gravy. And then anything sticking to the pan. Some Larry's on first. A little bit of Larry's. Then we need to put a little bit of Obey. Right? So, me and Nova eat this. Nova eats fish. Nova eats, uh, you know, she doesn't really eat a lot of baby food. She eats like mangoes, fruits. She's, I'm still breastfeeding, of course. And, you know, eating fish also helps with the omega. It helps with producing the breast milk. So this is my omega-3 pill. Look at how big it is. Oh my gosh. Or it's like a, it's huge. So I would rather this. So I'm gonna put some thyme on it. Right. So yeah, guys, how's everyone doing in this pandemic? I just been cooking and cooking and cooking. And now you see I'm doing more videos. So, hey, hey, my new subscribers. Thank you for subscribing. Welcome to the tribe. So, I'm going to be cooking and baking. Yeah, so I was vegan for like almost four years. And now, and then I went to Pescopalian. So, you know, I know a lot of people. A lot of my so-called friends at the time, they were not feeling that vegan life. But, I mean, it wasn't for them. It was for me doing my IVF, you know. And now since I have my daughter and she's 11 months and everything was successful, I am planning on having more kids. And I have more kids in the freezer from my last IVF. So... I'm planning on doing that and now I'm going to prepare my body so since since doing so I've been having a lot of fish a lot of omegas I've been doing I've been doing like um baked 
salmon, like bake like like salmon fish cakes, like the West Indian way in the morning. I've been having like grits in the morning. <laughs> I've been having a lot of different things, guys, but you know, you gotta have your essential. You don't have to. Dollar Tree sells um the water for a dollar and it is alkaline. So you know having alkaline water is great. It's the best water. Because our body is 90% alkaline, I believe. This is how it looks. If you go to Dollar Tree, it has 65 in it. I have not, but this is a dollar. You see how big it is? It's really huge. So I have one. I always have one drinking. So I'm like halfway down. <laughs> But enough of that. So y'all need to keep yourself alkaline in this these trying times. So I'm just cutting up the peppers. I basically put it all on top, put everything on, and I like the colors. I think it's so pretty. And you know, the more colorful your food is, your food is, the more you know. Dr. Sebi, he likes a lot of color. That's why I watch. I still watch him. So I'm gonna watch him forever. And even though he said that. Eating potatoes causes dis-ease. I love potatoes, like mashed potatoes. I don't eat it all the time, though. Um, and you know dis-ease is disease. Let's, let's get that right. So, is she saying mama? Let me try to sing it, mama. She's saying mama. So, yeah, guys. So, I was like, let me show y'all what I've been doing. I just been cooking, cleaning, moving of my house, you know, just here. So, I'm going to be meditating and showing you guys some more meditating techniques. And also, I'm going to show you um, some more breastfeeding stuff. For all my new moms and i'm gonna try to make some lactation cookies let's try that <laughs> so it's really fun so this is i love cooking first of all i should have been a chef but i also love taking pictures so <laughs> you know so i'm just cutting this up and it comes out so good it smells so good i just like all the colors you know what i don't like green bell peppers i just don't like because it basically sorry for the noise it basically has this bitter taste i like to cut out the middle it has a bitter taste like mm -mm, it's just not that's that's just not cool yeah i know i hate the fact i have to like not be able to play any music but so do y'all listen to tasha cobb so i love me some tasha cobb so i was listening to um because we need a move we need a move yes i'd be like yes god Early in the morning, I'll be blasting it in the, in the bathroom. I'll be like, this is mood. Yes, and Nova loves it. Mm, she loves to, you know, sing with mama. So that's the garlic. I did the thyme, the garlic, the parsley flakes. I just didn't do no. So the last thing I have to do, I like to like to put up the red onions. I like to get it really, really, really pretty. Like, I like my food to look so pretty and clean. Like, when I cook for somebody, the next thing I'm going to try to cook for y'all is some, maybe some macaroni pie. Well, uh, you could call it baked macaroni. 
This is not looking now. Not how I want it. So baked macaroni, like I was saying. So also, if you don't want to use red onions and use the scallions, it's fine because they're all from the same family. They're all onions is onions. And I use red onions because it's like the best to me and white ones. Those, are, those brown ones are the worst. If you look it up, those are like basically weeds. So like they're like the worst onions and they I feel like they sell them for like a dollar or 50 cents a bag like <sighs> in neighborhoods that people don't know and they think it's like a deal and then you eat it and it's like ugh, it's not really the best you know quality but you know whatever I'm not saying I this is just what I eat I just like it so you don't have to I'm not trying to tell you to eat it, tell you what to eat. You know what I mean? You do what you do. So this is what it looks like. Okay. I'm going to put some water just for the gravy part on both sides. And then put some foil on it. Oh, I almost forgot the best part. Some Frank's hot sauce. <laughs> you know the commercial? She be like, I put that shit on everything, that old lady. <laughs> what are you kidding me? Okay, so it's just a little bit. It just gives it like a little tang, swing. It's not hot. If you think it's hot, it's not. I don't like hot sauce. I don't like hot sauce and all that. So it's not hot. So we're going to put this in the oven. For like a good, I would say, 45 minutes. Okay, and now we're going to wash. I did like four. And I basically do my potatoes. Like, I'll have them with butter and some almond milk. Because, you know, I don't want the dairy. So, almond milk and butter and salt that's it and the salt i use is the salt right here and i believe i bought it i believe what is it morton's morton's sea salt fine sea salt i just bought it from the supermarket and sometimes dollar tree sells it so i just cut them up like not too small so that they could boil really good right put them in the pot Let's put the pot here so you can see. <laughs> so yeah, I was just thinking like, what am I going to do? Give me some ideas. Like, what do y'all want to see me cook? So I know how to cook everything, basically. Um, I'm going to cook some, some curry. So my friend is coming over from New York. She's coming to visit soon and she's going to bring me some curry powder some indie curry powder you know the Guyanese one yes honey so i'm waiting for her to come as you can see nova and we're gonna have some girl fun some girl fun because you know being here it's just me and nova and I'm basically in school, in nursing school, and online, everything is via Zoom. So, yeah, just me and the baby every day, all day, all the time. I had like my one friend, um, this woman. So, this is how much water I put. So, I let it boil down. All right, so now it's been 45 minutes later. Let's check. I got some parsley, some fresh parsley. Let's wash it. And let's see what this salmon is looking like. Okay. I want to bend down for the camera. But, ooh. Potatoes are finished. I'm gonna just put them on low. We'll just take them out. Ooh, let's see. 
Are y'all hungry? Because I am. <laughs> I know Nova is. She's like, like, Ma, come on. Okay, let's see. Ooh, yummy, yummy, yummy. It looks delicious. So here it is. Ooh. Okay. Okay. I'll show y'all a little closer picture. <laughs> so I just cut it. And I already have, let's get some. A new one. Here we go. Okay. Some almond milk. I put some butter just for the mashed potatoes. I put a little stick of butter. I'm gonna just mash it up. I could do it on a plate. But because I have the milk, I wanna do it in the bowl. I'll bring it closer. Just a little bit. You know, not too much. Not too much. Let's just get some potatoes. They're nice and soft. Ooh, put them in there. Yes, and it's gonna be so soft and nice. Alrighty. Now let's get to the mash and put a little salt. Ooh. At the fork. And I started cutting up some aloe. <laughs> Y'all know I love aloe. I'm about to make some aloe and banana and some strawberries. Here go the, here go the aloe right here. This is a new one. So in case y'all don't know this is how the aloe looks. So it cleans out your blood, as we know. And it helps with your skin, your hair, your nails, you know, everything. All that good stuff the aloe so I'm gonna have that with some raspberries and banana and strawberry I'm gonna just make a shake to have with dinner I didn't prepare it but this is all about the salmon so here are my strawberries here we go let's put everything out and that's what I'll do so just like my morning routine you know vitamin C booster drink it's the same basically and now i have i'm gonna do some fresh orange juice i have a bag of orange juice right Lucy? right she's over here laughing at me like i came off with it like give me the food give me the food already so we're just mashing it up mashing it up right just so y'all can, you know. That's no more playing in the back. Oh, I hear she's in her walker. Let's see if she make a premiere <laughs> at the end of the video. I'll take her a break. All right. in the dishwasher. <laughs> okay, so dinner is set. Yes, let's have some dinner. Let's see if y'all can see me. Bring it a little closer. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay, mommy's coming. I'm right here. You're okay. So I love how it gets so soft. And I love the thyme, the taste of the thyme, the natural thyme. I'm trying to get everything. <laughs> Got the mashed potatoes. Okay. 
nice and soft. Mm. Yeah. What you doing? What you doing, mama? What's the baby doing? What you talking about? She was like, mom, please. Just hurry up. <laughs> Just hurry up, mom. So I'm trying to show y'all. You know, make it look a little presentable, you know. Just a little. Right. And let's take this time out of here. And here it is. All done. Dinner served. gonna give a little taste test to my pumpkin <laughs> okay here we go here we go I got the food let's look ooh nice hi Lucy hi oh oh you want some din din I'm gonna eat, eat. Okay, don't <laughs> mind the clothes in the back. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Let's get some mama's mashed potatoes. Um, is it hot? Okay, no, it's not. Yeah. Mmm. Yeah. Woo. <laughs> She's so funny. Mmm. Is it good? Oh yeah, let's give a little salmon, a little piece of the salmon. She loves it. You love it? You ready? Um, thank you. Say thanks for watching. See you next time. Bye bye. Mwah. <laughs> Mwah.